And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. All right, now to get us started with the introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Calvin Keita. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Aljamain Punk Master Sterling. You ready to fight? Ready. He's a real high-level grappler, too. So when he gets you down, you, you generally don't get up, and there's a big, big threat of submission from Aljamain Sterling. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. To the body, and it lands. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. No surprise, DC, to see Calvin Cater try to establish that jab here. Is that New England cartel boxing? Calvin Cater, Rob Font, all those guys are so well versed in the. Oh, he's in trouble. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Clipped him with the right hand there. Fast pace here in the early going. Another. To the head. Doing a real nice job with these leg kicks, trying to slow his opponent down and largely succeeding. Nice punch to the head. Oh, masterful job by him controlling the range. Another punch lands. Pretty good straight punch there by Stewart. Went for the inside leg kick. Big land there. Nice kick to the body. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. He's trying to kick the leg out. Oh, nice little right hook there. Lands a good series of kicks here. Beautiful right punch, follows it up with the left. Right hand counter. Another stiff chip. Oh, oh, this one could be over soon. Sterling's going for the sub here. Looks like he's got that submission locked in. He's really advanced on the finish. Armbar. Oh, he got out. How good is that? This guy is so aware. He never leaves anything long to allow for himself to get sub. Oh, he's got his back. He needs to try to lift to return to the mat, so then he can try to chase the mission. Cater's now cut above the eye from that strike. That bears watching as this fight continues. Look at the control in the posture as that big knee lands. Calvin Cater gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Less than two minutes now to go. Pretty good position here with the single collar in the clinch. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Oh, great block there. Caught that kick there. Straight punch is true. Oh, he's staying busy here, connecting with a barrage of punches. Trying to play submission here. Oh my goodness, I think he might have it. Keeping busy from bottom position here. Oh, favoring position over submission. Very smart decision. You never want to value the submission over keeping dominant position. Sterling's attempting a triangle here. Let's see if he can finish the deal. Oh, good technique there. He's got the triangle choke locked in. Oh, he escapes. He got out. Wow, that is a great submission defense. Yeah. 
Still in hot pursuit of the submission here. He's going all in on his heel hook. He did a great job of getting here. Now he's got to secure his opponent if he wants to find a finish. Oh, submission defense holds up again. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Swing and a miss by Cater. 15 seconds. Body keep playing. Huge block there. Right. Second round, straight ahead. Hey, stop. Heading back to the corner now after that round. Cater's bleeding from the forehead there a little bit. It doesn't appear to be too bad. The focus for the cut man, though, to make sure that he can stop the bleeding and not allow the blood to get into the eyes. All right, well, the athletes have kept the replay truck busy tonight. We will take a look back at some of the highlights from that previous round. He opened a cut above his opponent's eye. And now the cut becomes a story. We are going to have to watch the placement of this cut. Is the blood going to start to leak into the eye? How is he going to be able to fight through the damage that was dealt on those shots? What a great round by his opponent. But now it's on him to make the adjustments that gives himself a chance. And it's not just the cut man who has his work cut out for him. We'll see if he can make those adjustments and rally here in this next round. Fast like he plays. Oh, Calvin Cater with the jab. That was the just about to it. Oh, nice body shot. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Oh, oh. oh my God. With one of the greatest knockouts you will see. Jeez Louise. All right, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer to wrap it with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 33 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Kelvin Keita. All right, as clean a performance as we have seen out of Calvin Cater, your winner tonight by way of the KO. Big power, but power is set up by...